Welcome, Leos. Um, I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is a, a wonderful alignment of energy for the month of September. Please remember to like and share these videos and keep positive, uh, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to be a very busy month and something is finally going to be ending in your life. So be aware of that. There's a whole lot of business that is going to be happening. And I and, and and at the end of the month, something really positive is going to be happening for some of you. So um, what we have here, we have five weeks in this month. Um, it's the end of your birthday season. Congratulations and happy birthday to all you Leos out there who are having birthday. Um, so let's see what is transpiring. You have the energy of the month of... Uh, uh September then you have um the energy of dealing with some sort of a situation with your mom and your materialistic stability then um that is uh, two earth energies so the first two weeks is going to be you um uh, Leo's are going to be really finishing ending this month this uh, year on a positive note then we see the energy of uh, um um the center is about you bringing back balance um, some of you have lost the conflicts uh, and you're going to be trying to build, bring back some sort of a balance in your world because you have lost a, a conflicts that some of you were um, going through. Then um, we see the energy of you moving forward. It is no victory and success. It is about you balance out some issues, situation you were dealing with your life and you're moving forward. There is definitely changes that is coming up. There has been worries, the worries, the conflicts in the is over and you are standing and still battling um, with a situations around you. Then we see the energy of you moving forward, whatever the issue and the situation is. I see you're protecting yourself from moving forward. Some of you are still looking back at the past. You need to start looking at the future. Um, then the last week is the energy of the magician where the magician is going to be bringing some of you out of some sort of an issue and situation. I see kids with the kids. I see problems with the kids. Kids are going to be off. Um, you're going to be resolving whatever the issue and the problems that is coming up. A whole lot of you um, have to think about your kids. Um, you're going back to work and a whole lot of you need to think about your kids. So whatever is happening in Transpire, I see this is coming up. So what we're dealing with is that we're dealing with a corporation institution and the first um, week you're dealing with the Aerophant and there is a situation that some of you are dealing with either with your manager at work or with an issue and a situation with your family. I see that your family is, uh, if your mother is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn, I see um, that your mother is trying, going to be trying to protect you. If you're married to this person or this person is a friend, I see that this person is going to be helping you out of a situation. But if you have been having conflicts with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person with a corporation institution, they and their family is going to be winning. Their wishes and dreams are going to be coming through. So it hung of uh, you if you have been working with this person they will help you um to create your um wishes and dreams to come true but if you were working against this person they are going to be the winner of this conflicts in a corporation institution then we're looking at the mother and if your mother is a capricorn i see some battle with this person um, if your mother is, yeah, a Capricorn, I see you're going to be having some sort of worries and battle with this person. I see a whole lot of conflicts. I see, um, you and this person are having some huge conflicts, but uh, this person is going to be winning. If it's your mother, they are going to be winning. If it's someone that you have done some conflicts and um, do some deceptiveness, lies and deceptiveness, this person is going to be coming out the winner. You can see that because the corporation institution is going to keys, choose for this person's side. Then I see some in uh, some situation where some of you could have been in a relationship with a um, with a cancer, whatever the issue and the situation is, whatever is happening. If you are the mother of a cancer, there is going to be some sort of a situation and issues that is going to you have to deal with. 
um, in order to help this cancer, whatever this cancer is. So I see you could be battling whatever is um, transpiring and is happening. I see truths are going to be coming out uh, about this young person and some sort of a situation because they're going to be finding something about this person. I see a corporation institution is going to be coming down on this person. Whoever this person is, I see this Pisces Cancer Scorpion is fighting and having some conflicts with a corporation institution. And the institution is going to be keep choosing for this woman. This woman is 50 years and older and they are going to be um, protecting this woman from whatever that was happening and was created. Third week, I see balances coming in where some of you are trying to balance out some family issue with a Pisces Cancer Scorpion. Whoever this person is, this person is between the age of 18 and 45 and i see you're trying to balance out some sort of an issue it could be your partner it could be a lover whatever is happening i see some of you are trying to regain um, um the love from this person or, or the happiness and joy from this person and i see that this is going to be um some issues that you need to resolve in this month then i see um there was conflicts if you notice um worries and conflicts that was happening and transpiring and this worries and conflicts comes because of some sort of a betrayal and now people are finding out exactly what was happening and transpiring and there was some sort of a betrayal um it could have been you who betrayed this person whatever is happening and transpiring people are really finding out and seeing the truth of what was transpiring so um i see um that some of you are trying to protect yourself protect yourself and your financial stability protect yourself and your kids um there is some sort of a ending that is coming in and i see you're trying to figure out and protecting yourself and your kid however this is happening and transpiring so please be aware of this issue and the situation that is transpiring then i see um the energy of uh, um, you're moving forward because you realize that you have lost a battle um, with a cancer. Whatever this cancer is, whatever was transpiring, whatever this battle was over, I see a lot of you Leos are moving along because you realize you have lost this battle. Whatever this battle, whatever that was transpiring, you have lost and you are going to be moving on. And so I see some sort of a um, regrets, regrets, um, but it's as if you're letting go of this regrets because whatever you were battling, whatever you were fighting against, I see that you have lost this sort of a um, battle that you were battling um, with someone. Um, you have lost and I see you're just going to be move on, moving on and um, just um, realizing um, um, the sadness um, that uh, uh, was created in your world and realizing that it is time to let go and move on because it doesn't really um, serve you. Um, it doesn't really serve you in order to hang on to that. And I see you are going to be, um, you know, just um, licking your wounds and moving forward um, and, 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 and um, balancing out the issue and situation because a lot of you were dealing with some sort of uh, um conflicts with a taurus virgo or a capricorn person it could have been your mom it could have been um a friend it could have been but whoever this person is they are going to be um um if you were working for our um being you, you know like being a friend to this person this person is really going to be helping you out um but if you were working against this person i see it's not going to be working out then we see the energy of the magician. The energy of the magician has to do with, uh, um, it's as if the uh, magician is saying, get up, get up. It's time to get busy. Get up. It's time to get busy. And the magician is going to be pushing you. I see some of you are having some sort of a conflicts um, with a, uh, a whole lot of conflicts around you, uh, conflicts with a Sagittarian because you saw um, some sort of a, um, false deceptiveness that was created with um, this um, this Sagittarian 
and how the Sagittarian has gotten you in some sort of a battle and some sort of an issue. However, this was coming up. And then I see truth is going to be where some of you are going to be releasing um, this inner conflicts and worries that you were having. So I see you balancing out inner conflicts and worries, balancing out um, conflicts, competition. Some of you were having some sort of a competition and you are definitely going to be balancing that out. Then we see the energy of the cross. And when we look in the cross is that you're balancing out your inner conflicts and you're balancing out com conflicts and competition. A whole lot of you were having some sort of a competition with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. This person is not in a competition, so you need to let it go. Whoever this person is, they and their child, there was some sort of a battle and they are protecting their child against you. So this person is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn who... Um, yeah, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, who has a child that is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion. And I see they took you down because of something that you have done to this child or you have um, created around this child world. And I see that they are protecting um, this child from you. However, this is happening and transpiring. And whoever you are, I see truths is going to be coming out in this month. But then I see here... As we look, happiness, uh, some of you were hoping and wishing for some sort of a um, happiness and joy between you and a Pisces, but it's not going to be happening. You and the Pisces is only having conflicts. Whatever is transpiring between you and the Pisces, you were hoping that you and the Pisces um, get a big win. It's not happening. And I see um, an end is going to be coming into the conflicts between you and the Pisces. Some of you are having conflicts between you and a cancer. Um, some of you have to decide to let go of an issue and a situation because it's no longer serving you. I see some of you are going to be finding some, some sort of a situation in order to balance out um, your world and um, some sort of a situation to clear as, um, the, the way for a child, whoever this child is, uh, because truths are coming out. Some of you are having some sort of problem with your child's father. If your child's father is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, you're definitely having some sort of an issue and situation with your child's father. There is this huge, huge problem that is happening and transpiring. And um, you can um, see this sort of a situation where a whole lot of conflicts, some some conflicts that is created around you was created by other people. Some of you are dealing with just a whole lot of conflicts. And um, however this conflict is, because we're looking at the diamond shape, um, some of you are having conflicts with your wife. Some of you are having conflicts with your pro your sister. Some of you are having conflicts uh, um, with an um, Aquarian. Some of you are having um, conflicts with an investigation. And um, there is just a whole lot of conflicts. And I see you are worried. But your worries is going to be coming to an end in this month. And you're going to be taking a loss and moving forward. Whatever is happening and transpiring... Um, in this month, some of you were hoping and wishing for something, but I see that the winner in this month uh, is going to be the Taurus Virgo, a Capricorn. She's going to overcome and um, overcome a situation that some of you had created for her and her child. However, it is coming up, um, her and her child, it could be your mom. And this is what I'm saying. Um, if it is your mom, this person is going to be help you. A corporation institution is having some huge conflicts with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, whoever this person is. Um, this corporation is really having, it could be your partner. Um, if it is a Pisces, I see some sort of a balance is coming. But this corporation institution is having a huge conflicts with this person. And this person could be your brother or a sister or a family member, but it is affecting you. However, it is affecting your life. I see a lot of you have a whole lot of competition and is trying to protect yourself um, because it's as if some of you think that, yeah, I have what it takes. And uh, whatever is transpiring, I see a whole lot of, uh, um, really a whole lot of, um, um, 
a stability that is going to be coming in your world, a whole lot of things that is going to be happening, fastness, things coming fast, things are ending, a whole lot of ending um, is going to be happening, we're positive, um, positive changes are on their way, and this is going to be good, okay, so a welcome relief from some troubled time, um, travel or relocation is going to be happening for some of you. So it is um, what there is no question about this. Um, what we're realizing and what we're understanding is that there is some sort of a stability um, that is going to be regained in your life. Some sort of a stability that is going to be happening and is going to be creating some form of resistance uh, in your world. And this is going to be good. So um, this is a month where you're going to be um, creating some sort of a transition now some of you have to make some decision um either at the at work or um some decision with a corporation institution you have to make some sort of a decision it could be for your kids okay so be aware then we see the energy of the magician and what we're seeing is that some of you had hope for some luck but i see um, that they're going to be choosing a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person because they realize what uh, has happened to this person and how this person um, stood up for some sort of an injustice that some of you have created. And this person tried to stood up to it and balance out uh, um, the injustice that you people have created. So um, whatever it is, it, you're... It, the, you're not going to win a situation against a Taurus or a Capcom because a corporation institution, governments has been realizing and understanding what has happened to this person. And um, you guys have done something. If it's your mom, your, this person is going to be helping you out. So we're looking at a situation with a Capricorn woman. I see you have lost, um, lost um, this battle. Um, I see there is no win. I see this person, a corporation institution, I've seen um, that this person is uh, um, the one who is the right person. Um, however, it is transparent. This corporation institution is seeing that this lady, um, whoever she is and whatever is transpired, that um, a corporation see that she is the one and is going to be healing whatever that some of you had created against this person. I see a, you were competitive. You were having some sort of a competition against this person and uh, her um, child. That is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion. It could be your mother-in-law. And you were having some sort of a competition with this person or um, pretending to be this person. And I see a corporation institution realize and know who this person is and that this is the right person. So I see you losing this battle. Um, there is no question about it. You're definitely losing this battle. Whatever battle that some of you had with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn a woman, 50 years and older, you're going to lose this battle. You know that it's not your documents and your information. You already know that. So you fight in and um, whatever the Pisces had done and give you this information, you and the Pisces are going to be in for some real conflicts because um you're going to be pissed off at the spices or the cancer that they have gotten you in this issue and this situation okay so take your um yeah it is a it's a whole lot of competition so i see um a loss um you have lost this battle um i see you want to move forward um uh, i see you realize uh, um the transition and you're trying to move forward and the transition that is transpiring. I see whatever the issue and the situation is, is that you are um, still standing and still having this competition. And it is time for you to let go of this competition. It's time for you to bring the situation to balance. It is time for you to understand and realize that um, this issue and the situation is now over. You are being given a new chance in order to bring balance and protect your kids, okay? Because you know, you um, you know what exactly has happened and what exactly has transpired, and it's as now the universe is coming in and is giving you some sort of a time in order to create and balance out some sort of a battle. 
um, that was created. Okay. So it's going to be a fast, fast pace month, especially business people. Um, it is going to be very, very fast, a fast paced month for all of you business people, people who have business is going to be snap, snap, snap. Um, you're going to be busy, busy, busy. So this is good because, um, some of you, it was kind of relaxed. Um, there was no client customers coming in and now it's going to be busy. There's a lot that is going to be going in. I see a uh, stress that comes from having so many things to do. A lot of you are going to be busy doing a lot of things and it's going to be okay. Um, some sort of an ending is coming in, but it's a positive ending because you're going to be overcoming some sort of a situation. Some of you are dealing with a Pisces, whoever this Pisces is, you are going to be having some sort of an ending with this person. So as we look at uh, um, the um, mirror, um, some of you are having some sort of a issue and situation with a corporation institution and whatever is transpiring, um, it's, it's time, it's as if they're saying it's time to let go. Okay. Um, you have some regrets what you have done to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. You really have some regrets and I see you, um, wish you had not done what you have done to this person. Whatever is transpiring, I see some sort of balance and healing is going to be coming in to the family. There was some um, uncomfortable issues that some of you were dealing with the kids and that sort of a thing. I see um, um, this situation is going to be coming in where some of you are going to be getting pregnant. Some of you wanted to get pregnant and I see that this is going to be happening. Then I see some situations. Some of you could be returning to your mom or returning to a sister or a mother figure. Some of you could be buying a new car. This is going to be good. Then I see you're protecting yourself from a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person. Now, whoever these two people are, some of you are protecting yourself from a Pisces. Some of you are protecting yourself from a, um, a Cancer. And really, um, you you guys are really like, yes, I don't, I don't want to have anything to do with this person. This is not an healthy situation for me. I need to step back and release myself from the connection. Then I see the energy of uh, no success with a situation. And I see the situation has just stopped. There is no success that is coming out with a situation because there is a lot of um, competition, a lot of quarrels, a lot of fights, a lot a lot of competition that is going on around you. And some of you are having some sort of a competition with a Cancer and a Libra and, um, and, a, and an Aquarius. So be aware of this. I see a lot of you are going to be making some a positive change for your kids. So, um, so I love you guys. Um, please remember to like and share these videos. There is just a whole lot is, is going on. Um, but whatever is transpiring or whatever the conflict is, you just have to move forward. Um, and, um, it's going to be a very, very busy month, especially for you, Leo. The two first weeks is going to be uh, um, extremely busy. As you go to the two last week, you're moving in the energy of the Virgos where I see some sort of an ending and situation is going to be transpiring. So take this move on and understand that you are about to release yourself from some sort of an issue um, that you got caught up with and you're going to be freed from this situation. I want to say to you guys, just keep positive. It is um, a time where you have to keep positive. It is a time where um, there's going to be coming in some sort of a help from a sister. If this person is a sister or a mother, they're going to be helping you. They're a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Whoever this person is, um, they're going to be really helping you out uh, in order to resolve some sort of an issue and a situation that was happening in your world. Okay, Whoever this person is, is really there as a sister or a friend. And is going to be balancing out and helping you out. I gotta go. Namaste until next time.